What's up dudes and welcome to Saturday Technique class. I am just waiting for my computer to boot up right now. It's taking its sweet time. So in the meantime, we're just gonna kind of go over some technique stuff and talk about what we learned last week, etc. Um, so everyone has already stretched. I hope so, because your plies are gonna hurt if you try and do them without stretching. So if you haven't stretched, Press pause, come back to this in a few minutes, and go stretch. Watch classes one or two, do that sequence, that warm up, and come back to me, okay? And let's go, everybody else. So, first things first, let's go over um, first through fifth positions. First position, holding a beach ball. Shoulders are not up here, not down here. I'm not hunched over, I'm not up here. I'm not here, see that? Pondu, second position. Pondu, second. Pondu, fourth. There's space between my feet. Tondu, fifth. Tondu, first. Other side. First position. Tondu, second. Tondu, fourth. Tondu, fifth. And back to the beginning. Tondu, and first. Cool, adding the arms. We're in first. Let's tondu to second. Tondu, remember breathe in, breathe out, fourth, breathe in. Let's go here for fifth, why not? And then back to first. You can either, if you're in fifth position, you can either tondu here and then close, or you can go to the side and then close, so back to second. So whatever one you want, it just depends on what your teacher wants to do, I guess. And second side, first position, tondu, second. Fourth, fifth, let's tondu second, and back to first. Okay, so again, those tondus are basically your transition movement between postures, so poses. So if I'm in first position, tondu second, I'm gliding my foot along the floor. I'm not wearing ballet shoes right now, but if I were, it would be a lot more slippery, so you would be able to hear my feet sticking to the ground. Or not sticking, I should say, sliding on the ground, right? So, hear that? Okay. And where are our feet always turning out? Or, <laughs> I just gave you the answer. Our feet are always turning away from each other. We never want to see our toes being friendly, right? They're always facing away. So fifth position, fourth position, they're turning still, looking away from each other. Not like this, not like this, okay? Um, I want to go over some stuff at the bar when we do some more tondu stuff. Um, oh, adding arms and head, that's right. We did that too when we went through tondus and everything in between poses, so. Positions. So first position, again with the head, I mean I just kind of mentioned it, so breathing up, exhale on the land, exhale on the land, exhale on the land. Now, when I'm at the bar, say my left hand is on the bar and I'm doing everything on my right side, I'm looking towards my hand, like a, you want to think about like a robot, like a robot wouldn't be like, they are awkward, but at least if it's here, it's not going to turn this way, right, it's looking towards it. Right, you're looking towards your hand. You're following your hand. You kind of want to make like as long of a line between your eyes and your hand as possible, if that makes sense. Because if I go like this, I'm like right there. It's harder to read as if I'm away from my hand. So at the bar, your head, the top of your head is always turning like away from your hand, right? Okay. Also, when you're at the bar, um, let's see, first and second position, Anything that's done out here, your head is gonna be facing forward. So, say I'm doing a tondu warm up, which we will be doing shortly. Um, I'm gonna tondu, when I'm tondoing to the front, in any position, right now I'm just doing it in first position, but fifth, first, whatever, if I'm moving my foot to the front, my head is turned out, okay? If I'm doing it to second, to the side, my head is turned forward. No matter where I'm crossing it, if my leg is going out, tondu to the side, I'm looking straight forward. And then when I go to the back, 
my head goes where? Also out. So if I'm going straight up and down, I'm looking away. If I'm going out, so if, do you see that? My head kind of goes the opposite way of my legs. So if I'm going parallel to the mirror, so straight up and down, I'm looking the opposite way. And then when it's going this way, I'm looking the opposite up and down. If that makes any sense. I really hope it does. Um, my computer just turned on, so let me go grab some music. And we will do a warm up at the bar like we did last week with the plies and all that good, good stuff. Another term that we can talk about today while this is happening um, is a port de bras. Port de bras. I don't even know how it's spelled or how exactly to say it, but I always used to think of portable bra. Yeah, I said that. Portable bra. Port de bras. Port de bras. I think it's like a halfway hand movement or something. I have to look that up, so I'll get back to you. But in the sake for the sake of going over new things today, we might as well. And all that is is a movement of your arm. And all that is is your move, your arm goes through all of the movements. Up, out. So 